if you own Photoshop and in case you want to split an image such as this one, so you have a transparent PNG file where each element is uh, as one layer, so they are not uh, separated. What you could do is use this Photoshop script here that is available to download split to layers and this script is actually separating each group of pixels that are connected and not transparent into its own layer. So after you download this file you need to move it into your local disk, program files, Adobe, Adobe Photoshop uh, folder under presets and under scripts. So you need to move that file that you just downloaded, you need to move it here uh, into this folder. Now, after you do this, you go back to your Photoshop and go to file, go to scripts, and it's going to be listed here. You will see it here as split to layers. If you click on that, it's going to give you option to uh, select split when gap is larger than 10. And if I click preview, it is going to show me how exactly it's going to split this image. So if I increase the gap to 50 and click preview, you will see now that this is going to be one image. This is going to be one image because they are physically touching here. So I'm going to reduce the pixels to this and I'm going to give them name Easter and I'm going to click OK. And now you see the black mask, black and white mask on the background. For some unknown reason, it is telling me that there is 68 layers. You can ignore this. There will not be 68 layers. So you can click yes and let it run. And when it is finished, so you, you see how long it takes to separate one image, just one image. I'm not speeding up this video, I'm just I'm showing you in real time what is happening in the back. And the script is finished. And if I do this, you see that now I have each of these elements as individual layer. So that is inside Photoshop. What if you have multiple files? What if you have 5,000? Okay, it's not 5,000, but what you have 50 or 100 or 200 of images such as this one where you have multiple elements on PNG file and the background is transparent and they are all uh, separated uh, with the transparent pixels. How are you going to do that? And how are you going to do that if you don't own Photoshop? Because we all know that Photoshop and Adobe, they have some issues with the way they are offering uh, pricing on their products. We're not going to go into that. So if you have uh, issue with that, if you do not have Adobe Photoshop, what you could use for this same thing is my fancy program that I just uh, released. It's available on uh, Gumroad. Let me just switch to this one so we can actually see my uh, program. So once you download the program from my Gumroad uh, store, double click on the exe file and it's of course it's for windows if you own a mac uh, buy a pc <laughs> that's 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 it that's all, all that's the best advice i can give you if you own a mac just buy a pc for all these kinds of things and then once you click on exit it will give you this tiny little window where uh, you need to select the location of your png folder now it is important that in this folder you only have transparent png files that you want to process no other files should be inside that folder and i'm going to give you uh, i'm going to show you what uh, folder i'm going to use so i have a folder with these three images as you can see they are similar to the ones that i just process in uh, photoshop so i have three of them and i'm going to go back to my script uh, the location is uh, d drive and d folder oh, that's it and i'm going to click on run and look what what is going to happen and just also count the time it is going to do it is going to split all these images so i'm clicking run and we are that's it we are finished 
So do you remember <laughs> like three minutes ago what we did in Photoshop? And let's click OK. Let's minimize this and let's see what do we have here. As you can see, I have these images. And the reason why I have these images is because there is a tiny, you see this tiny dot here. I can easily delete uh, these files because I do not need them. So everything that is too small, I can delete that. And I am left with every single element split. So that's it. I have all my uh, slices here, all my individual elements in this image. I have them sliced. If you are wondering what is this, if you like this, this is my, uh, this is a part of my first Easter uh, watercolor collection. It is available for completely free on my Creative Fabrica store. So if you are interested in making some uh, crafting with uh, Easter watercolor elements, go check that out. And that's it. That's, that's the video. Uh, this tiny little uh, Python program that is splitting PNG files into individual layers. And of course, once again, I repeat, and also you have that note here, the script will separate each continuous group of pixel to its own PNG file. The origin PNG files must have transparent background and the folder must only contain transparent PNG files. If you receive an error, that is probably because you have a PNG file that is not transparent or you have JPEG file or you have some other file in the folder that the script is trying to process and it cannot. And of course you have my YouTube channel where you are watching me right now. So you can uh, subscribe if you want. You have automatic link to my Gumroad, my Creative Fabrica store, and also my Facebook group where I torture people with my new ideas every single day. Thank you very much everybody. If you have any comments, uh, ask me down below. And as usual, until next video, I'll see you down below in the comments. Bye everybody and stay safe.